get you out of my mind It's like I feel it for the first time Been thinking about you all night I've been searching for this all my life what to do y'all welcome back to my channel if you don't know who i am my name is julie rodriguez welcome to my channel subscribe like comment turn on your post notifications so you get notified every time i upload a video and for those of you who know me hello again and welcome back i am having like a self mental health day not really it's more like an after afternoon because i was at work and today was just like a weird type of day i was a little bit of had a little bit of anxiety today throughout my day and let me tell you guys i've been suffering from anxiety for two years now and it sucks it really does but I will say, I first got anxiety, or I started feeling anxiety, it was rough because I'm also in my car, so I know different scenery and whatnot. I'm at the beach. Um, yeah, I'm just sitting here at the beach. It's a little spot I like to come to and just kind of like watch the ocean and chill out but I just want to talk to you guys for a minute okay kind of talk about mental health and what it means to me because because I suffer from anxiety and depression it's hard for me to live a free life meaning you know I have to put more effort into living my day because it's rough i get anxiety throughout the day and or in the mornings or at night and it's not all the time thankfully it's not like it's been two years since i've had anxiety and for sure at the beginning of the year um of the year that i got it it was really hard for me because it was something I did not understand what was going on and like I never felt that way so because I started you know doing research and, and, and explaining how I felt and then I realized that it was anxiety and it just it sucked because it was taking over my life I couldn't be out for certain hours of the day or once it was nighttime it was like oh I have to be home I can't go out um, also it was like going out to social events I felt like crap because every thought in mind comes to you you know and it sucks because I would think I would feel safe being out and stuff and even though you know our world is scary and crazy you know i should be able to live my life to the fullest um and i do this because it's hard when you have anxiety because you over you're an overthinker you overthink everything you put yourself in such a negative mo uh, mood and sometimes you don't even know how it happens really you don't it just happens you know anxiety creeps up maybe not for everyone but for me it definitely creeps up and it's just kind of hard to cope with but one thing i will say is my anxiety for sure has gotten a lot better i still get it here and there and now it's like i know when i'm about to have anxiety and i can kind of prepare myself for it and kind of just I've, I've done exercises to help me um like I will try to think positive thoughts, I will distract myself with positive thoughts, I will, you know, manifest positive thoughts. And this is another thing, you guys, I am on a spiritual journey right now. Don't get me wrong, I do believe in Jesus and I, I am very much still religious. Oh, my camera died. <laughs> I knew it, but, um, what was I saying? Anyways, I'm on this journey, you know 
spiritual journey and there's just a lot of stuff that I feel like I'm learning and it's been helping. Like I said, my anxiety isn't as bad as it was, you know, at the beginning of when I had it and it also helps to know that they're you're not the only one who feels this certain way. You're not the only one who's going through this. Um, but my point for this video is just to talk about a journey and how I've been coping with anxiety and depression. Because let me tell you guys, I feel like depression came, came with my anxiety. And I've done my research and I've talked to someone about it and it ma it's made me understand that yeah, at some point given, I did suffer from, from depression and that is the worst thing anyone can go through. This is just, okay, just random thought, okay, just thinking about it. I am surprised I'm not even crying about this because... I feel stronger, you know, I feel like I can talk about this and I've been wanting to make a video like this for so long But I have so many other videos that I've recorded in the past That I thought oh, you know, I can add this and add this but I've, I never edited it I never made it into a vlog. I've never done anything with it and a lot of them have to, have to do with me talking about mental health But you know what? All that footage when I recorded myself I was deeply in my depression my anxiety it was living i'm not saying okay and i'm not saying i'm not i'm not living with it right now what i'm trying to say is that every day is just a work in progress and for anyone who's going through it right now or has gone through it and relates you know i'm here for you guys i really am and i'm also up and willing to learn more you know so if y'all want to hit me up you guys can hit me up my socials or add your socials um in the comments and i'll hit you up it, i know it's hard to ask for help i know it's hard to say how you're feeling i've been there guys and i'm still going through it and uh, and i'm not gonna say i'm completely 100 percent okay with who I am with you know I'm just, it's a work in progress it really is I'm still working on myself and it's just been a lot easier because I'm in a more positive clear mindset you know and every day is a day an opportunity to just be better and do better and I really like I said I told you guys I've been woke I really have been woke okay I'm woke because and I think a lot of it has to do is because I'm on my spiritual level and let me tell you guys like I'm gonna brag about this but it's the best thing that's happened to me because I feel like I believe again I feel like I am striving for something that I want you know I'm striving for who I want to be and it, it's making me hungry it really is just to tell you one thing okay I'm trying to lose weight, you know, so I'm also on a, a fitness journey, but it's not really a fitness journey. I'm just trying to get healthy, you know, I'm, I'm making this a priority and I'm trying to get healthier up here and because this is how this has been a process and it's been, I've been getting a lot better. It's also been making me want to change physically and I am, you know, I've been working out, I've been making life changes in like my diet, you know, it's it's been great and I've been seeing improvement and I haven't been I'm posting about it or I haven't, you know, really, I, there, there's certain people who know about this and some of them actually some of my friends they're in it with me but i i'm i'm trust me i'm documenting everything so i have a lot of stuff documented and i maybe come out with that video who knows in the future 
so we'll see i don't know if i'll i don't know if i'll post it but it'll it'll probably be sometime in the future when i post that but yeah um there's a lot of stuff i want to talk about and i think it's gonna be a future video that i might do and i just need to figure out of a the right time and the right way to talk about It was just a day where I felt like a bit anxious throughout the day and y'all let me tell you coffee does not help with anxieties coffee does not help for anxiety so um thanks guys for taking the time to hear me out and just kind of me explain certain things to you guys and just kind of let you guys know where I'm at mentally and just know that I'm trying, I'm succeeding in certain things, so I'm 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 happy. And I wanna be happy. And for those for any of you who need help, who need someone to talk to, please, please, please do not hesitate in reaching out to me. I might be nobody, but I am somebody that will sit there and hear you out. I will read your messages, I will answer your phone call, your FaceTime call, your Snapchat, whatever. Um, I am here if you want to talk. This is an open invite to anyone who who is in it, in need of talking to someone or venting or just letting go of something that's burning inside you. So um, I will post my socials down below. And I feel like you can't reach out to me, but you would like for me to reach out to you. Comment down below your social and I will hit you up. I will totally hit you up. Because let me tell you, I am here for you. Okay, but I just want to give a quick appreciation to this freaking moment right now. Like, what? This is beautiful, this, you guys. Oh my god, I love where I live. I seriously do love where I live. Central Coast, baby. But it's beautiful. It's kind of cold, so I think I'm going to go. But again, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys soon. And send you guys all my love and hugs. Thank you. Bye.